Januari mosi akiwa katika kaunti ya Mombasa Rais William Ruto alionekana kufutilia mbali hofu ya kupanda kwa gharama ya maisha kupitia ongezeko la bei ya umeme. There will be no additional charges today or going into the future on electricity bills to the people of Kenya. Hata hivyo miezi mitatu baadaye mamlaka kudhibiti kawi nchini Epra imetangaza kupanda kwa bei ya umeme. Wanaotumia chini ya uniti 30 watakuwa kilipa shilingi 12 kwa kila uniti kutoka shilingi kumi. Wanaotumia umeme zaidi ya uniti 30 hadi moja, sasa watalipa shilingi 5 na senti 80 zaidi kwa kila uniti. Baadhi ya wakenya sasa wanasema hatua ya Epra inaongeza chumvi kwa kidonda. Sasa hivi matumaini medidimia. Manaka wale ambao tulikuwa tunawatazamia tunaona ni ahadi tu baka wa leo. Malikuwa akituahidi wakati wa kuachagua na sasa hivi bado wanatuahidi. So tunashindwa. Ni lini? Ha mambo ya kutakuja kutimia. The president is not living up to his word. He is really telling people this and he is doing something different. So it's like that is a formula of uh, making people to understand him or rather to make him survive in his political career. Sisi kama binadamu tunashangaa. Kumbe hii ofisi na konga na kitu, utakaingia na sahau. The Kenyan power monopoly should end because they have enjoyed it for too long. And I think people should be very honest. Kenya power has taken us Kenya for a right. In tatu mtatano nane na kusilingimia na hapo kisamani mwaka kama mmoja iliyopita nilikuwa nikimoisha token za mia na pewa unit kama 5. Token ni shilingi 200. Hata imalize mwezi kinaenda kama wiki moja au wiki mbili itakuwa imesha. Wengine nao wanaamini ni swala ambalo ni zaidi ya serikali kudhibiti. Street mafia are doing. Kujaribu kuonyesha kwamba we want to up, nini kuinua the prices of uh, the electricity but again government inawaambia tunaenda chini. So from those fights ni kama kubargain. So the government and the, those mafias are trying to bargain. So I can say that uh, the common mwananchi lazima ataumia kidogo now that price itaenda juu kidogo but the government ajaribu kutukushia chini kidogo these people are trying to in any way to bring the government down so we are waiting to hear from the president himself William Samoei Ruto Bunge la Kitaifa hivi majuzi limekuwa na mjadala huo wa gharama ya juu ya umeme nchini countries of producing electricity that means that between geothermal and hydro alone we are overshooting our numbers in the country So there is no need to bring this conversation about tariffs and, and, and everything else. Alisimama kwa kanisa at the pulpit. Na akasema ya kwamba bei ya stima hakuna siku itaongezeka kwa wakati wa uongozi wake. Kwa hivyo hii ni watu ambao wanataka kuaibisha rais. It is time to desist from uh, making populist comments yeah, and deal with the issue of cost of I live in uh, at with sober minds. Hata hivyo kionekana kutetea serikali ya Kenya kwanza mbunge wa Manyata analaumu vyombo vya habari kwa kile anachoamini ni kupotosha wa Kenya kuhusiana na bei ya umeme. But all this is propaganda from the media. So I started by clearly saying let the media stand with the truth. There is nothing right now that can come to the National Assembly that is increasing the burden of common man. Joel Chacharuninga ya K24 Nairobi